What's up, YouTube? Starting a new playthrough of a very old game. Maybe not very old, but The Witness. This is a puzzle game that I've seen some of it played, but I've seen it forever ago. Okay, so use the mouse. Got it. All right. Nice and simple to start. The mouse moves very slow when it's in puzzle mode, and it moves very quick when it's in look around mode. Okay, don't hit space. Shift, does it run? Shift does seem to run. Okay, we've got a puzzle, but it's covered up. There's going to be lots of me wandering around lost, most likely. I like that the camera kind of like fixes itself when you zoom in on a puzzle. You have to click once you complete it. I kind of just expect it to finish itself, which doesn't make much sense. Okay, let's follow this yellow line. Hold shift. Where did that yellow line go? Already lost. I might pause at points if I get stuck on a puzzle for a while. We'll see. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's weird not seeing the mouse even though... I don't know. It's hard to explain. It feels... Okay, maybe it's just that the mouse slows down compared to when I'm, like, looking at things. But it doesn't feel like it's moving at the rate that I'm moving it. If that makes any kind of sense at all. This game is gorgeous for a 2016 game. Alright, we've got one of those three done. Let's follow these lines. I also don't know how much of this I want to play every day. Or every video, I guess. I kind of want these to be longer videos, I think. I think, I think. Ooh, you can see yourself in the shadow. Alright, we've got a maze. There are lots of breaks. Lots and lots of breaks. Why am I not seeing this? Okay, we have to go... No? <laughs> There's more than one start point. Got it. Wow. Okay, and each of these puzzles is supposed to, like, kind of teach me something so that you slowly learn how things in the game work. All right, we've got two out of the three. So that one, I think, was teaching me that there is more than one start point. Is th There's no jumping. Hitting spacebar again just takes me into puzzle mode. Okay. There's more than one end. And it lights up different lines depending on which end I choose. This is the one that goes back to that door. So let's change this. Okay, so it's the same path, right? Maybe. Just way longer. I want the sensitivity to be increased while in puzzle mode. I wonder if I can do that. Settings. Field of view. One thing I'm noticing, there's no sound settings in here, just field of view. I don't know what reticle means. Weird. Okay. Ooh, there's purple glowiness. I'm already lost. How am I already lost? Okay, but we've opened the main gate. Yeah? 
interesting that this has multiple ways it could be completed. Okay. So now we're free. We're out of the castle. Into a big world with a sea. I'm looking for any, like, electrical lines, and I'm not seeing any. But this does look like a door. Okay. A door with four start points, three end points, and a bunch of things that I don't know what mean. I was going to say, maybe I can't touch any of those, but there's definitely more to it than just that. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm ready for this one yet. Okay, we're out of that puzzle. Okay, so dots and black and white squares. This looks like something I could do. And it's got my black and white squares. Okay. I like that it flashes red if something's wrong. Okay, so we just have to separate the black and the white ones. Got it. I think? Yes. Interesting that this one looks like it's, like, slightly green. Okay, it's just the shadows hitting them different. Got it. I'm kind of curious. There's no way for me to separate out, like, could I separate them into three groups and would it still work? But there's no way to do that. That I can see very easily. My end point is different. Okay. Easy enough. So here, I do have to separate them out into three groups. So yes, there can be multiple groups of white ones and black ones. There's a different end point. Got it. Different end point means that we have to go this way. Another different end point. This one feels like it messes with me. But I don't think it does. I think this time I just have to separate out these instead of... Got it! All right. So I learned how to do those. Is that enough for me to go open that door? I feel like it could be. Ooh. Or I could get distracted because there's another door. Okay, the puzzle is on the other side of that door. Hopefully, I'm looking over at my recording stuff. It looks like the volume, if anything, might be a little bit low. Maybe I should turn that up. And it looks like the frame rate's going to be okay. Like, things aren't going to be too stuttery or glitchy, hopefully. I'm going to review this after the first video. But I would like the first video to look decent, so hopefully it's good. Okay, this is teaching me the other thing that I need to know. So, is it just that I can't run over those? No. Is it that I have to run over those? Yes. Got it. Do, 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 do. Got it. Ah. Got it. The difference between when I see it in my head and when I execute it. So it's got to be this way. It does not. I think you actually have to start here. That doesn't make sense. 
Never mind. <laughs> I've already... No, this is it. Okay. Cool. I wonder if... These are going to scale up so much that they kick my butt. Like, how long is that going to take? It's looking like not all that long. So the only way to get this one... I think this is the place that I have to start. Bam. Okay, we got it. Alright, so now I know how to solve that one door. It's just, can I find that one door again? There's a wall here. Let's go back and look for it. One more time. There was a path leading right here. Simple. Okay. Oh. Okay. So I have to run over all of these, and I have to separate things, and I have to pick one of three exits. So it's not possible to get both of these if you start here. This is looking like an okay start point. You have to use, like, the whole mouse pad for my mouse pad <laughs> to be able to do this. And I don't think I can let go, like, partway through. Separating these is tricky. Ah. <sighs> How do I deal with that? That puts the white one in with the black ones. I don't think this is correct. Okay, so if I come up here... Can't get that one now. Got it. This is already getting to be a little bit tricky. So that's wrong. That could be right. Bam. We're there. The slowest door of all time. has a super secure box with the easiest puzzle of all time. What? Okay. I feel like I should write this down. But maybe not. Okay. Onwards. I'm still not sure why that door had three different exits, but one of the exits wasn't even possible, at least. Maybe two of the three weren't possible. Okay, so we found a door with a piece of paper. I see I keep wanting to jump hitting space. There's no jump so far in this game. Okay. Okay. There's no control, there's no... It's just shift. There's no zoom in, but I see an apple. There are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 15 branches. And on here, there are 8 plus another 7, 15. The fourth to the last is the apple. That would be this one. Interesting. Okay, that line went somewhere. Why is this tree? Okay. <laughs> like, why is this tree screwed up? All right, seventh over, seventh from the left. Right there.
Bam. Apple, but the tree is kind of weird. There's only one branch on the far left. Why is it like this? Okay, bottom line. There's no bottom line. This is weird. I think it's five from the right. But this tree is less clear cut than all the others. What? Okay, it turned off. <laughs> See, you can't just spam try thi- This one's still right, though. Now I've forgotten which it was. It was the seventh. As soon as they turn off the lights on me, I forget which it was. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Is it wanting me to look at it from this point of view? Yes, I see the broken off branch. Which is why there's only one on that one side. That's still fifth from the left. Isn't what fifth from the left what I had? Now I'm afraid I don't want this to turn off on me. Wait, one, two. <laughs> the one with the broken branch is on this side. It's fifth from the right. I don't like you. We got this. Okay. Looking at it this way. <laughs> Looking at it this way. I don't know which way they want me to look at this stupid tree. There are multiple interpretations to this puzzle. Okay. Three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That doesn't seem right. Counting from the other side. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I don't fully understand this. Oh, it is counting these four branches over here on like this branch, this branch, this branch, and this branch, I think. Weird. I get it. I totally get it. There's one branch here, there's two branches here, there's four branches here. I think I get it. There are a total of 16 here. Does that make sense? Yes, that makes perfect sense. Okay, I just want to make sure I actually understand what I'm doing before proceeding to the next. Okay, maybe that was the last of the trees. No, it was not. Okay, so what have we learned? We've learned that from the left, it's two, four, eight, or two, four, six, seven. Don't you turn off that old one. This game. Where is my stupid line? Okay. We're totally going to get through the trees today. Totally going to happen. Okay, there's a broken branch. 
Does the broken branch matter? I feel like it shouldn't. All I can think of is that I have to do it from this side instead of that other side. Also, there's a gate here. Open up. With apples. I swear that should be seven. All I can think of is that it's seven on this side. This one right here. Why is the game like this? It shows me... I see. Right here is the broken off branch. So that shows me the perspective that I have to look at the tree from. We get it. Okay. Next up. I see broken off branches. Two broken off branches. What? There's no apple. And there's more than two broken off branches up there. Okay. I see more broken off branches. I see a total of three broken off branches, but I see four. Four on the tree. I'm supposed to identify the missing broken off branch. Which is... No, I was trying to point in real life. Yes, this is real life. This one. And that one is number six. From the right. this one easy game we got this and we opened that gate we can now eat apples I keep wanting to jump we can get a knife game over we win all right there are little trees there's all kinds of stuff there's a human heart Is this showing that these vines are very vein-like? Possibly. I can't jump. Okay, so this just let me into an area that does... Oh, there's more... No. No, that's it. Oh, but we get to peek down there. This is a windmill. I feel like this area should lead me on to my next area, but maybe that is not the case. Okay, out of here we go. Glowy pink and purple tree area complete. There's a stack of tires. Let's go investigate the stack of tires. They are not tires. They are cavemen tires. Okay. Yes. That is a thing. There is this place, which feels like it should have a puzzle, but there's no puzzle in its holder. But, it's interesting that the game auto-locked on it. Like, if I click right here, it doesn't auto-lock on something. If I click here, it does auto-lock. And there's definitely a power line. We can do this. Ooh, a new door. An easy door. Interesting. What? Okay. 
see power lines coming in and going out. More power lines. Where do I start this one? Right here. Got it. I think. So this is going to be mirrored. It starts out easy, gets harder. This one's going to be fun. <laughs> Trying to look at both sides at once. Got it. I see a lot of breaks. Okay. What? This one. Okay. I was going to say doesn't seem solvable, but it definitely is. Just have to slowly follow both up as they eat up my entire mouse pad. I can start here or here, but you can't start in areas that are blocked. Okay, I'm learning things. Wait, let me look at it for a second game. There are four exits. This one seems tricky, but maybe not. does seem tricky. Okay, we got there. Is there a thing where I have to go to those two outside ones? Okay, we've opened the world, which has a highly reflective sea, ocean. Ah! Oh. It did drop me down for a second. I thought I was going to go in. Okay, one of my only complaints so far is I would like to be able to, like, jump and interact with the terrain a little bit more. But the game feels really good. The puzzles feel good so far. Um, interesting. Got ya. So the immediate thought is to rush this one over to this one, but that's definitely not the case, or the correct answer. Wait, maybe it is. Okay, I see. Hey, a thing. So instead of this one going to the top left, it probably does have to go down. No, no. <laughs> Got ya. Why is the plastic melting? Because the game is messing with me. That's a dead end. That's it. This one, the meltiness didn't seem bad, but I could see this coming, where the meltiness was going to be very bad on this one. Um, can't be down there. Can't be there. Got it. Okay. That actually wasn't bad. And this went back outside. This is where we followed it in. A puzzle appeared on the door. An easy puzzle. I have to cover up all of these dots. But I don't have a mirror image. Weird. Okay, so it has to go this way. Why? Do I click the thing? I was running out of mouse pad space. Okay, we have to go over this one first. I had it, I just clicked. Okay, that's it. Why? 
is the game like this? I have to cover that up. Since when is there one right there? I didn't see that. Okay. I just wasn't paying attention. It's not doable. It really isn't. It's one or the other. Am I stupid? Possibly. Um... I need to open these flaps. That's why they're there. There are trees. <laughs> I don't think the trees have anything to do with it. I think that power line could, and I just noticed a path over here. Hey, this looks like something that we know. Easy game. The first one's always easy. Okay, so we have to get that one first. And then we have to go back down, and we have to go in. Can't do that. Now this one would be stranded. Can't do that. Okay, so there was one right here, but I don't have to get that right away. Can't do that. Could do this, but now this one's stranded. Have to get that one. Have to get this one. <laughs> have to get this one. Okay, give me a second. Oh! It's... No. <laughs> I say, oh, like I got it. I definitely do not have it. That one up top is messing with me pretty bad. This one. Okay, so first off, I have to get this one. I come back, I do this. No, I've already screwed up. I go down one further, now this one's trapped. This game is messing with me. Um... Again, I keep trapping. Okay, let's look at this for a second. So the tricky ones are these ones that are in the halfway points, and there are three of those. The best way to get those is to go down here first, come up here. I've already trapped one. Go all the way over, come back, come up. We've got it. Okay, figure out the ones that are problem ones. Go on from there. This one's a problem one. This one's a problem one. These two are problem ones. And we're starting on the opposite sides, which means that this one could end up here or it could end over here. Wow, like that would be good. All right, problem ones. That doesn't work. This leaves me a lot of space. That cuts off my own snake. I've already trapped this one. Okay. Untrapped it. What if... I've already trapped this one. Then we have to go for this one. Uh, 
That solves it. I think there were multiple solutions to that one. Why does this one look so easy? This one's the tricky one. How tricky is that one? Not that tricky? Okay. Did I turn up... No. The light on the other side of the door. <laughs> Why are there different colored lights? Because I have different... How do I get... Oh, okay. Whichever one I click on, the opposite. Got it. The opposite one is yellow. So if I click up here, this one's blue. This one is a little bit tricky. But not bad. There are multiple exits. Why are there multiple exits? So I just have to pass these, but I can do it with either color. Whenever they're trying to teach me something for the first time, it's really simple. Then it gets more complicated. This one all feels pretty simple so far. This one's tricky. This one's tricky. This one's tricky. Yeah, see? That tricky one, you have to get that first. I think I have to get that yellow first. Then this one. Come up here. That yellow has to go get this one. Come over here. Weird. Um. It's not possible to start up here because then I can't ever get this yellow one. Yes, I could. But then I can't get the blue one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have to start here. I have to get that one. I think the key is not to get that tricky one near the exit yet. isn't it's not the solution because I'm this yellow is wrong <laughs> the whole path lights up red okay and then this one flashes I like that tells me what I got wrong all right let's get that yellow first let's go get this but then I can't Okay, just get the yellow first. I like this. This feels solid. That almost is right, except for this stupid one at the end. Now they can't cross back by. Wait, wait, wait. That's it. That's almost it. Ha! We've got it. Okay. That was a little bit of a pain. Now I've lit up a yellow and a blue, though. Okay. <laughs> okay. I just want to follow the line, but I can't really. Wait, wait, wait. We're here. 
Nice, easy. They're gonna have to cross. The yellow has to pick up these. I think they're both tricky ones, so I think that's my priority to do that first. Okay, so I should be going down here, over here. Why is the yellow becoming more transparent? I have to get that one. Um, so I have to get that. I have to end with the blue in the top right. I think I have to have already picked up this one. Looking at two things at once is tricky. Hey, we got it. That yellow is fading. I don't know how easy it is for you guys to... Okay, now it should be more easy to see that it's fading. Okay, which is distracting me from the fact that I have to get those tricky ones and I have to end up here. It's going to be almost transparent. By this last one, I'm not even going to get to see the yellow one. You just have to keep it in your mind. Oh, I don't like that. It's so important to see that second path. They're going to give me nice, easy ones for a second, and then they're going to make it super hard. I can't see the yellow anymore. So for the yellow to get that, it has to come here. Then we have to go here. Then they crash into each other right here. Then it goes like that. I don't like this. Okay. So... I just have to think about where the yellow one is on the blue map, which is right here. Easy game. I have to mirror all of these. So like this one is down here. This one is right here. This one is right here. Does that make sense? Yes. Where did I say that other one was? Right here. Okay, at least that was the last one. I follow it. I get what's happening. I like it. Did I move that piece of metal that was blocking the thing? The gate. Am I trapped forever because I get lost? Yes. We've done... No, that was the gate that was already open, right? Okay, there's my stack of tires. No, this is the gate. It's open. We've done it. Okay, you have to get that one first, then this one... Then you go in here. We have done it. All right. I was going to say is 45 minutes good, but this looks like an end to a puzzle. It looks like completing something just because there's a lot here. I wonder what's this one looks nice and simple, which probably means that it's a trick. It is a trick. How is it a trick? Okay, before we do that one, I actually know how this side works. 
This side is a pain. Okay. Have to get that one first. Okay, this doesn't work. That doesn't work. You have to get this one. Then you go get these. Then you go over here. Then over here. Then up here. Got it. This looks like a total pain. Okay, give me one second, beepy thing. All right. Easy game. Okay. There's four start points. I'm guessing... No, you can't start at this one. You can't start at this one. You can't start at this one. It has to be this one. Why is that one so easy? And why is this other one so hard? Okay. Is it just copying this? No. My memory is really bad. I can't copy that. It definitely is not copying that. Oh no. It definitely is copying that. No, no, no. Okay, this one's easy. All right. This is good for me. This is a memory test. Luckily, it's a pretty... Was this up or down first? Pretty easily, easy memory test. Okay. It was definitely not that. Bam! We've done it! Weird that that doesn't lock on. A present? A rocket launcher? T-shirt launcher? actually know what this is. It's a laser beam. I have seen a little bit of this game played, but I mostly had it on as like background noise. But I have seen a bunch of lasers pointed at a mountain. And that's totally... Okay, never mind. I thought that that's what this was. Okay, it is. It's just super slow. I was going to look for another power line that I had to turn on to, like, activate the laser. Yes. Okay. I have seen that part of the game. Again, like, six years ago? Is that what 2016 was? Yeah, when this game came out. All right. I think that's going to complete the first video. Next time... Maybe we head off over here. See if there are puzzles over there. So yeah, give me feedback. Let me know if it was at all entertaining, boring, if I should cut parts, if I should turn up volume, any of that stuff. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.